Chief Executive John Lee says he has secured preliminary support for the so-called reverse isolation proposal for cross-border travel. A makeshift hospital near the frontier may be used to test the scheme, Chloe Fung reports. After slashing quarantine time for airport arrivals, the chief executive hopes that a reverse isolation scheme can increase cross-border travel. Zhang Li said officials from Guangdong province and Shenzhen had expressed preliminary support for the plan, in which Hong Kongers will isolate locally before crossing the border under a closed-loop system. It will be based on the 7 plus 3 formula, seven days in an isolation facility, followed by three days of quarantine at home. The 10,000 bed makeshift hospital in the Lok Ma Chao Loop near the border could be used as a trial. Main purpose is to first of all uh, alleviate uh, the burden uh, of hotels in the mainland and uh, making use of the facilities in Hong Kong so that uh, there will be more uh, opportunities of allowing uh, quarantine facilities for uh, the wishful travelers. It's not known when the scheme will be launched, if there are any fees, and whether there will be an increase in the cross-border quota, now capped at 2,000 daily. Chief Secretary Eric Chen will head a task force that will work out the details. Li was asked if Hong Kong has given up on seeking quarantine-free travel to the mainland. We are looking at all options uh, beside uh, this quarantine new quarantine arrangement. Li added that 13 new task forces will be set up to improve cooperation between Hong Kong, Guangdong and Shenzhen on the development of the northern metropolis, finance, employment and shipping. Chloe Fong, HKIBC.